Breach. Brave Souls. Hello, everyone. Happy New Year and happy Shinigami Sunday. My name is Roxox, and welcome back to another episode of Breach Brave Souls. Uh, so this is actually my second time starting this recording because uh, the genius over here forgot to put the mic into my headset. Yeah, uh, fortunately I didn't do anything, although I did mention that was there was a very cute thing when I opened the game the first time to get the download started with Kone and Ichigo for the new year. And there are daily bonuses for the new year, so I'm probably just going to be logging into the game every day to get the bonuses, particularly the orbs to do summons. But I'm not actually going to play every single day. Like, when I play, I will be recording. But also, we have some very, very exciting things with the summons. Because, look, look at this. Creepy ca uh, No, Toxic Candyman, not creepy. Toxic Candyman showed up. But, but he, he brought candy. <laughs> and yes, I'm calling them candy. Because I get to choose. I I get to just choose six star characters. And the best thing from all of these options. Hang on. Whoop. I forgot, I need to click and hold. Sorry for the dramatic pause. I'm I'm channeling my inner calculon here. It's wifey! Wifey! I have wanted to summon Wifey since I started this game, but yeah. Ladies, gentlemen, and envies, this is my Bleach Wifey, Brengi Hu. Look, look at her. <gasps> She's so pretty. <laughs> and sparkly. I'm so happy with this. Ooh, very, very sparkly. Was that the last one? Nice. So... Yeah, I can get, oh, I can get wifey, which is very, very awesome. Um, obviously I need to get Aizen. Th this is just gonna be a game of pure favoritism. Oh, there's two Aizens? Okay, that took me like close to an hour. <laughs> Wait, I only get one? Oh no! I spent like an hour going through them, not just focusing on the picture, but their attacks as well. Oh, dang it. It's fine. It's fine. The only one I made an exception for was Wonderwise, just because he's cute, he's gonna be the one that shows up, isn't it? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh! If I could only get one, I'm so glad it is her, because I specifically chose this one because I need a powerful Momo. Oh! Oh my gosh! I chose them because they literally set the enemies on fire. Okay, did it suck that I didn't get all 10 of them? Absolutely, but I'm happy with that one that I got. Yeah, you know what, Let, let's just do a summons. We might get someone else cool. Oh, three butterflies again? Shadow! I'm not complaining. Hajike. 
We got another powerful Momo. Nice. Oh. Very nice. Very, very nice. Oh. I know I gave him a funny name when I oh wait I can't say that on YouTube <laughs> never mind best of friend knows what it is it, it is not YouTube friendly I mean not too bad not too bad at all Okay, let, let us finally get into actually doing something here. Let us go back. And let us get all of the gifts. And then we will finally start actually doing something today. Um, let us choose the team. Obviously, we are choosing this child. This adorable, sweet little baby. Sorry, Nal. No, yeah, me. Um, I really liked his attacks, but I want to give other people a shot. We we finally have a high-level Chad, so let's put him in there. And you know what? Since he was there and was typically like here, have some cold summons. Let us take Toxic Candyman. This is totally not influenced by the fact that this Brenda is now cosplaying cowboy version of him on TikTok. But yeah, let, let us see what we can give this child. Okay, you get a bonus from the food as well. Yes. Um, you also get a bonus from this. Why'd you get it on... Oh, because of the thingy. Okay. Does anything else give you, in particular, a bonus? Okay. Um, let's see what we can give you. We will give you the nerd glasses. Because it just suits you. And I think we gave that to Nal as well. So, let... Let's just move it over to you. Then I suppose we also need to give Chad something. Sorry, but he he gets that. Um, yeah. Oh, look at powerful little Momo ready to set the world on fire. <laughs> That is so cool. I have no idea what we are doing in the story next. I assume we have a reading thing to do. Yep. Hey Rukia, I've got your dinner here. Oh, I know what part of the story it is. Damn it, why does she always have to disappear right at dinner time? Compassion, friendship and affection. They're a nuisance. All these feelings aren't necessary for a soul reaper. I've remained in this world for far too long. It's time to move on. Yes, you finally get it, don't ya? Huh? Hi, Renji! <laughs> but you know, I've really gotta hand it to you. I'm very impressed. By skulking around so long here in this world, you actually managed to prolong what little life you have left. That's a mean, Renji. Rukia. Renji, what in the world are you doing here? So you're telling me you had two hunters from the Soul Society lurking right behind you, but you were so lost in thought that you didn't even notice? I'll grant you that you spent the last few months in that gigai, but still... Don't you think you've grown just a little too lax? Spit it out, Rukia. So where's the human who took all of your powers away from you? I think I messed that up. So where's the human who took all your powers away from you? What are you talking about? Just because I'm inside a guy right now, it doesn't mean I've lost any of my power. And anyway, 
Why would you even think it was a human who took that power? It was a human, it's obvious. Just look at you. Otherwise you wouldn't have that stupid human expression on your face. That's mean, Renji. I know I said that already, but he's being mean. And that's even meaner. You're a run from the Rukon district like me, and yet you are taken in by the noble house of Kuchiki. They put a lot of time and money into making you the perfect Shinigami, one of the elite. Huh? Am I wrong? You're the great Rukia Kuchiki, aren't you? Gaping like some worthless human. What the hell is the matter with you? Right, Captain Kuchiki? Nisama! <laughs> Rukia. Byakuya. It's you. I'm gonna say Nisama. That, that's more fun to say. Plus, you know, Shinigami powers to a human is a grave sin. Now tell us, where's, where this human is, Rukia? It's over. We're taking you in. And then we're going to find the human who stole your powers. And kill him. Ichigo! Rukia's in trouble! Look at this right here! What is it? What's the matter with you? It's obviously a farewell note. You see, Rukia? She left us. She's left us for good. What do you mean? She left without even telling me she was going? Shut up, shut up. How would I know? I was right here with her when she decided to go. She just up and left here without offering even the slightest explanation. Who the hell cares about you? <laughs> oh man, what is this? Damn, Rukia, what the heck are you thinking? Hmm, for certain reasons I must go. Do not look for me, and do not worry. After you read this, make sure that you burn it. And also, if you can, keep yourself hidden for a while. I don't get it. I mean, she doesn't even give a reason for leaving. Something must have happened. She said to burn the letter and keep ourselves hidden. What could be so terrible that got Rukia this worried about us? Isn't it obvious? Something's happened between her and the Salt Society. Use your head a little. Rukia's in the middle of something and she doesn't want us involved. So she... she stuck out on her own. Let's go, Cone. I'm changing into a Reaper and finding Rukia. Alright, I'm with your buddy. Uh, do you mean... again? I don't have another choice. I've got to get that gi Gikong... Gikongan! I know how to say it! Why can't I say it when I see it written like that? Out of your belly. No! No! Wait! Ow, ah! Hi there. Boy, looks to me like you're in a bit of a bind this evening. You're that guy. Yes, he is that guy. That's gonna be the title of this video. That guy. <laughs> no, no, it's gonna be something to do with Momo. Is there anything I can do to help speed things along here? It seems my customer's in a bit of a pinch. I don't usually do this, but I can put this one on the tab for you. Great, we did some reading. Let's go! Chapter 21, Rukia's Shadow. Rukia has disappeared after leaving a farewell note, but Ichigo's go- Ichigo goes after her. Hollows appear one after another to block his paw. Did that actually happen? Also, it's not me now checking if I'm not muted. I'm not muted. Yes, I'm not muted. Okay, we've done all the things. We just need to do that. Oh! Hello! Okay. I guess everyone has shiny ones now. And I have them too! <laughs> there goes my nose itching. Lovely. I need to figure out how to do that. I didn't even notice star ratings on the accessories. I should really pay more attention to what's going on here. Oh! Oh, are we just... Wait, wait, what did that say? I... Oh gosh, I missed what it said. Never mind, we'll figure it out as we go. Nope, 
Nice! Got the trash cans too. I guess there would be something on how to set things on fire. Hang on. I want my D attack to. Oh, never mind. How do I set things on fire? Whoa! Minimum follow. Why? Why does it have little minions protecting it? Oh, because the little minions were the hollow. Oh, she's so cute! Oh, dang it! Does the mouse just move into the middle of the screen without me moving it there? I need to pay more attention. Chapter 22, Find Rukia. Ichigo is rushing to find Rukia, however, someone else is on hand to help Rukia from being abducted by Renji Arborai. Ab abducted? Captured. I can't read. I did too much reading when I was selecting characters just so I could only end up with one of them. I call this dude Typo because of his name. Like, I, I refuse to put the effort into learning how to actually pronounce his name. Okay, I am specifically moving the mouse out of the way. Oh, that is quite a punch. But the little... Oh, wow! Okay, sure, sure. That's not even S yet. Oh, I thought there would be more. <laughs> that was a bit too much. Oh, that sounds like a full-on swarm. Dang, this dude pack packs a punch. I mean, he should. But still, that is intense. Uh, can D hurry up and... There we go. They are so polite just waiting for my powers to charge up. Oh. Did I get the trash can? Yes, I did. That is a big one. That is a big one. Come on, come on. Charge faster! There we go. Oh! There it is! Oh, it's still up! Don't you try and... you know, roar at me or whatever. Did I hit the space ball for Hinamori? I didn't. Oh. I'm sorry, did he just start off with All Might's line there? Oh wow. Nice shot. Dang, this thing will not stay down. Whoa. Are you still not down? Oh my gosh. Oops, sorry. Dude, just go down! Stay down! Oh my gosh! Maybe Hina Mori's one was too easy. Also, this mouse is moving to the middle of the screen. It is not me. That's kind of annoying.
Very nice. Okay, I guess I'll have to do four ones today because I need to give Hinamori another go. So I can hit spacebar. Anyway, chapter 23, A Giant Sun Pacto. While Uryu confronts Renji, Ichigo is still running around Karakura Town, trying to find Bukia. Okay, I'm not putting it off the window completely. I will just have it in this corner, and hopefully that will work. Oh! Toxic Candyman's turn in front. Why are you showing up twice in a row? It's because I saw his little thing on the thing where I could select 10 characters and I just went straight past him, isn't it? He's mad at me now. I don't care. He's a typo. Rukia, don't even try to protect him. This is it. Two armed men attacking a defenseless young girl. I have to tell you, it's not a pretty sight. Tell me, who the hell are you? Hmm, <laughs> just a classmate. One who hates Shinigami. Don't tell him that! Oh gosh, you also have a thingy. How do I how do I do the extra thingy? Yeah, if anyone uh, knows how, please to let me know. Although I'll probably see it while I'm editing. Wait, I still have it. Oh, this wasn't enough. Trash cans? No trash cans. Okay, next we're gonna try D. The sound of his shoes. Like... <laughs> that may have been a bit of overkill for just one. Oh, it's still up. I cannot get over the... Why is Renji there? Oh, right, I'm, I'm fighting Renji. <laughs> We're not keeping up with the story. Now then, let's finish this off, shall we? Remember this as you depart this world. Renji Arbora is the name of the man who killed you. Pleasure knowing you. Wait, am I actually going to be fighting Renji? Ooh, that's gonna be awkward. Huh? So who the hell's name are you? The name is Ichigo. I'm the one who's gonna beat you. But... How's it going? Oh! Oh, why actually am I fighting? Oh... Oh, 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 he's back, he's back. Oh, run away, run away, run away, run away. Wait, you're a horror. You can be running away from him. He's a child. <laughs> Check out that overgrown Zanpakdo. Oh, yeah? You're saying I. <laughs> You're saying I got a big one, huh? <laughs> uh, I am a mature adult. It's funny, to tell you the truth. I've been thinking this thing looked kinda big next to Rukia's blade. But you know, I've gotta say, up until now I haven't had anything else to compare it to. Oh, I get it. You're the lonely human who took Rukia's powers, aren't you, Carrot Top? Huh? Man, you're as dumb as they come. Rukia came out here on her own just so you wouldn't have to get involved. You should have stayed put at home, but you had to come play the hero. Very soon you'll be dead, and Rukia will get her powers back. And then Rukia will go back to the Soul Society to die. Renji? You okay there? Poor <laughs> <laughs> <Orangey>. Angie. <laughs> Hang 
on, hang on, hang on. Does that mean my next fight will be against Biakuya? And I'm going to have teeny tiny Hinamori against Biakuya. Oh no, so ranging. Chapter 24, The True Power of a Zanpakuto. Why do I scroll all the way down there? Ichigo faces a god... Fa faces off against Renji, who plans to take Rukia back to the Soul Society. Ichigo seems to be holding his own until Renji summons his Zanpakuto and changes the course of the battle. Also, can someone tell me why the mouse keeps moving to the middle? Like, why? Why? Why must you be like this? This young man here, Ichigo Kurosaki. I believe I've seen him before. There was a report from the stealth force. He dealt with the Menos Grande quite a serious He dealt the Menos Grande quite a serious blow and forced him back to Huecamundo as well. You've gotta be kidding me. Man, the stealth force must really be slipping up be slipping these days. This kid wounded a menace grande? Who in their right mind would believe that load of doo doo? Okay. Mouse, stay stay in that corner there, please. Oh, uh, what am I pressing? Aw, Mr. Trash Can. <laughs> he huffed and he puffed and he took a blow to the mouth. Okay, that's a nice attack. Well, you can only hit them one at a time. That's precious. Here we go! I mean, look at him and then some Pacto. So tell me, what's the name of that monstrosity? Huh? What's its name? Wait, are you guys telling me you all name your swords? I knew it. You're not even able to ask your Zanpakuto its name. And you really think you can fight me as an equal? Come back in 2000 years. Raw zombie mode! Now open your eyes, see what lies before you, and fall upon your prey. It's all over, you little runt. Dude, stop calling everyone runts. You've lost to Renji Arborai, and will die where you stand. Oh, wow. <laughs> Momo obliterated him. His spiritual pressure's increasing. Impossible. And yet it is. Hang on, there, there's hair that decided to just randomly get all up in my face. I don't understand what's happening to me, but I like it. I feel no pain from my wounds. In fact, I feel totally invincible. Thank you, Season 2 Gojo going after Toji. This is about to end. I win, and that's it. Yeah, guess again. Quit playing around, Reggie. What? Was it him? Is he coming? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Had to. What just happened? Did he cut me? What's more, if he did, I can't tell if I was hit from the back or the front. Even when you were falling. Ichigo! No, don't. Frenchie, let me go! <laughs> I got him involved in all this. It's my fault that Ichigo's dead. So what the hell's wrong with me going to him? So even if it would make your sentence harsher, you truly feel that you must help him. 
Is that what you're saying to me? I understand, Rukia. This young man does indeed bear a striking resemblance to him. I had this conversation about who they're talking about like a week ago. He's dead, you say. There's a striking resemblance to him. I'd rather that you quit talking about me like I'm not even here. Got it? Itchy. I see. It looks like he won't be needing your life. We should leave here now, bro. Me, Summer. The actions Ichigo just took have opened my eyes to the truth. I'm ready now. Take me back to the Soul Society. It is time that I atone for my sins. You can't leave here now. I mean, our work isn't finished, Rukia. I see no need to inflict a final blow upon him now. Leave him be. Soon enough he'll die on his own. Wait, Rukia, stop! I clicked too fast past that. Don't move. Take even one step or try to come after me, and I'll... I... I will never forgive you. Ooh, such a big threat. You're going to die, so why not stay put and live a few seconds longer? Alright, I will not inflict the finishing blow. Rukia, wait! Do we get to see the doors? I can't speak. I can't move. I was protected. Again. <laughs> He's getting like, you okay bro? Still alive? <laughs> she is so cute! Oh, did I take too long to- I did not take too long to do that. How did I miss the star? <laughs> Ah, never mind, it's fine. That... that seems like a good place to end this. I have a powerful Momo! That is so cool. That is the best thing ever. <laughs> oh! Okay, I'm paying attention now. Four stars. Um, Okay. Anyways. That is it for this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you did, be sure to like this video, leave me a comment. Please let me know how to get the thing to make Hinomori set people on fire. Oh, it said so in the thing. I will see it while I'm editing before this goes up. It's fine, it's fine. But thank you for everyone who's been leaving me advice in the comments anyways. I appreciate it. <laughs> But yeah, that is it for this episode. Um, I guess next we're doing the training thing with Kisuke. Who am I going to pick? Am I going to take a version of Ichigo? I probably should. We we fought with Chato, so... Maybe, just maybe, next week we will do Ichigo, uh, Orihime, and Uryu. Do I even have a powerful Uryu? I have a powerful Ichigo, I have a powerful Orihime. Who's gonna be the third person that I take with? We will find out in the next episode. I forgot to do the whole outro thing properly. I'm I'm out of practice. It's been like three weeks since I last recorded a gaming video. But yeah, um, if you want to see the next episode as soon as it comes out, be sure to hit subscribe and book the bell. I'm posting new videos every Shinigami Sunday. So yeah. Um, I already asked questions, I said the next episode things, so yeah, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next week.